Hello, welcome to Pure Land Channel. I'm Karen. Today's topic is swastika, which may surprise you. Why is there a swastika in Korean Buddhist temples? Before answering the question, I have a quiz for you first. Is it true or false? The Nazi party created the swastika symbol. Is this correct? <coughs> it's wrong. The swastika was often found in many ancient cultures in Europe, Asia, Africa, and America, almost worldwide, as an auspicious symbol. The Nazi party only borrowed it for their insignia and named it Hakenkreuz for their own. And the second quiz is also whether the following statement is true or false. The swastika in Korean Buddhist temples symbolizes good luck and virtue. Is this correct? Yeah! Yes, it is. In some Buddhist scriptures, the swastika is mentioned. According to the Flower Ornament Sutra, on the Buddha's chest is a mark of greatness shaped like a swastika called the auspicious clouds of sea. Also, another sutra mentions that looking into the original Sanskrit sutra, the swastika is a shape manifesting the very virtue. It is not a letter originally. Actually, Empress Wu of the Tang Dynasty made the shape of the swastika an official Chinese character in order to promote Buddhism in China. One of the oldest Buddhist examples of the swastika is the footprint of the Buddha made in the 2nd century during Kushan Empire. On the toes of the Buddha, the swastikas are carved. Right-facing swastikas are on the right foot, whereas left-facing swastikas are on the left foot. Right-facing and left-facing swastikas. Both of the types have been found in Korean Buddhist temples. Right-facing swastikas are often shown in the Buddhist paintings during the Korea dynasty of Korea. And left-facing swastikas have been more widely used from the Joseon dynasty of Korea. Also, the left-facing swastika used to be a symbol of Korean Buddhist temples. But now, the symbol was changed to a new one in 2005. You will find this symbol on the gable of a Buddhist building. This is the new crest of the Joge Order of Korean Buddhism. The Joge Order is the biggest denomination of Korean Buddhism, which has over 2,800 Buddhist temples in South Korea. The reason for changing the crest of the Joge Order was that the swastika was used not only by Buddhist temples but by shamans or other cults. In addition, the extremely negative image of the swastika imprinted by the Nazi party affected the decision. The name of the new crest of the Joge Order is the Wheel of the Three Jewels. The outer circle means Dharma Wheel. The three dots inside the circle represent the three jewels of Buddhism. First, the Buddha, second, the Dharma, Buddha's teaching, and third, Sangha, Buddhist community. If you find this video helpful, please like and subscribe for more. Thank you for watching and see you next time.